going to be the champion. I'm going to be the number one fighter in the whole, whole entire world. Pound for pound, I guarantee you I will be the best fighter in the world of all time. That's my all-time goal, so until I reach that goal, I ain't stopping. I hear you want that belt bad, the MFC belt. Yeah, it's already mine. I'm just going through the motions now, and it'll be mine soon enough. management you just got to do what you got to do and make sure you get it done uh, the most important thing is the training so as long as you're training with good people training with good sparring partners and stuff and putting in the work then everything else falls together I've been I was already talking to the guys down at Raw Academy Vancouver on uh, Kingsway 2211 Kingsway and so they offered me a job coaching there they said I could train there anytime I wanted bring all my coaches there whatever I wanted to do so yeah, I started training there. I'm still I still train at Revolution. I train at train at Pet Boxing. I'm gonna I'm going to Vegas next week, but then when I get back, I'm gonna start going up to SFU, wrestling with Frankie and the guys up there at SFU. And uh, yeah, I got I got to be open to all options, right? Like there isn't really one gym in the Lower Mainland that has everything I need. So I got to kind of take this from there and this from there and do what I got to do. I was always kind of like. The picked on kid a bit and I've always like liked Ninja Turtles and like Karate Kid and all that so I always wanted to be a ninja ever since I was a kid right so this is pretty much the best oh, thing I can come to that without actually chopping people up with swords so that's what I'm doing. <laughs> my, my heart is in MMA if I wasn't doing MMA even if I was making hella money acting I still wouldn't be truly happy you know what I mean so I gotta do what makes me happy. Number one, baby, Team Raging. <laughs>